so excited to welcome you to Sweat's Monday Night Meetups. I absolutely love seeing all your pictures, all your videos, all your comments from last week. Honestly, the response has blown me away. And tonight we have another amazing session for you. Now, during these challenging times, it's really important that we support one another. And that is what tonight is all about. I hope that you can just take a little moment out just for yourself to work out tonight, to feel strong. And I'm so, so glad that we have this time together each Monday night, honestly. You, me, and thousands of women all across the world are about to sweat together and together we will stay strong. Now, like last week, before we get started, I wanted to answer some of your questions, which I absolutely loved. Okay, so first question is, Amelia in Spain says, what's a good substitute for a skipping rope? This is perfect timing, literally because tonight's workout, we are doing abs and cardio and there are so many great substitutes for skipping in this workout. So stay with me, we're about to work out and you're gonna have so many substitutes for skipping rope. Okay, so Laura from Dublin says, wow, I can't even make it through one workout. Is this hard for everyone or is it just me? Okay, so Laura, I feel like you're putting a little bit too much pressure on yourself. So for anyone who feels like this is too hard or it's getting too hard, slow it down. Take your time, focus on your form, focus on your reps. No one is rushing you and there is no shame in being a beginner. So take your time, focus on form and slow everything down. And don't worry about if you can't get to the end of the workout, doing something is better than doing nothing at all. Michelle from Melbourne in Australia. How do I organize my week? I can never seem to find the time. So that was me. I was in the same position as you. My top tip. Sweat has an amazing planner. If you have sweat right now, book in all your workouts. If you book in your workouts, you're way more likely to complete them, but you wanna be able to see your workouts this week. And if you cancel a workout, think of it like an appointment. So rebook it back in another day so you can actually see your week, you can move your appointments around, you can move your workouts around and you'll feel organized and ready. Got a lady from Tokyo asking, what type of workout is your favorite to do? Literally this one, okay. I promise, I can't make this up. This is my favorite, favorite workout to do. Abs and cardio, and I'm about to take you through my ultimate, ultimate abs and cardio workout. So we're about to smash up my favorite workout, and you do not need any equipment. So thank you so much for your questions. Let's get straight into it. Keep them coming, those questions. I wanna keep answering them. Don't forget to take pics. Don't forget to take videos. I wanna see how you all go. Tag sweat. I'm so excited. Let's get ready to do my favorite workout ever. Sweat trainer, Kayla Dean is here. Welcome to week two. Now this is my absolute favorite way to train abs. A Little bit of abs, a little bit of cardio. Now I love this so much because it makes me feel good. It makes me feel empowered and I couldn't do it for so long. So after having Anna, I wasn't able to do anything for around six months. So I'm so excited to bring you this workout. It's gonna make you feel fitter. It's gonna make you feel stronger. It is high intensity just like last week and there is absolutely no equipment. So if you're sitting right down right now and you are watching this, I want you to get up, get some shoes on because we're about to work out. Now, while those people are doing that, I want to say a few things and they're the same things I said last week. So pay attention. Three things and I'm going to keep saying them. The first thing is I want you to go at your own pace during this workout. Okay, so take it easy, modify those exercises to suit you. Number two, don't give up. I want you to keep moving. So at any point, if you feel like this is getting a little bit too hard, get up, dance to the music or change the exercise, totally up to you. I want you to feel as comfortable as possible. And the last thing is, and I said it last week, don't stop until the music stops. You're gonna keep going. I'm gonna give you modifications. I might step off the screen, I might come back, but I want you to keep going. Don't stop until the music stops and I'll count you down. All right, so the same as last week, we're gonna get into that warm up. It is the same warm up and I love it so much. You can use it anytime. Let's start straight away. So everyone, we're gonna get down on the ground and we're gonna start with that warm up. Now you're gonna need this. All right, we're down on the ground, guys. We're starting in three, two, one, and we're going back into that child's pose. Now it's gonna start off slow and we're gonna increase that intensity. 
stretching out those abs. You are going to need to stretch out those abs. Back into that stretch. Coming forward again. So we're just going through this motion. Back and forth. 10 more seconds. Keep going. Three, two, one. And we're gonna go underneath and we're starting with these thoracic rotations. Oh, my back just cracked. Underneath and up. A few seconds per side. That's good, swapping sides. Really stretch out, take your time with these. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. And we're moving into hip flexor stretch. So really opening up those hip flexors like we did last week. Other side. So we're gonna do two rounds of this, guys. Good, perfect. Moving into this 90-90 rotation. So we're gonna come forward, stretching out our glutes, and then we're gonna turn to the side. So if you can see where my legs are positioned, 90 and 90 degrees, forward, stretch out that glute, and then rotate towards the back. Stretch, rotate. Stretch, and rotate. Swapping sides. Forward. This is good, well done. We're about to increase the intensity of this warm up. If you were here last week, you know what's happening next. One more, and then up into those jumping jacks, so straight up, straight up into jumping jacks. That's it. 15 seconds. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, down on the ground as the mountain climbers. Now, if you want to, take these slow because we are doing an abs and cardio workout. Warming up. Push it out. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and up. Let's go. Butt kick. Get your feet up, 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 up. Okay guys, 10 seconds, 9, 8, we're moving into high knees, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, high knees, up, 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 so really warm that body up, well done, alright, we're going to go back down into that absolute child pose, 5 seconds, 5, 4, 3, 2, one end. Stretch it out. Stretch out those abs. Breathe. Warming up that body. We're gonna do two rounds, guys. We're just repeating this all over again. 10 seconds to go. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, and back into that rotation. That's it. Good. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, and moving to the other side. Opening up 
Out body. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one, into hip flexor. All done. So we're breathing, we're getting ready to go back into those high intensity warm up. That's good, stretch it out, breathe. And swapping into that 90 90, remember, forward and towards your back foot. Forward and towards your back foot. Your back straight. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Swapping sides. I really want to make sure your body is nice and warm before we get into this workout because it is a high intensity abs and cardio workout. You will be sore. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Straight up, let's go into those jumping jacks. I was saying last week, I always get stuck with these because I call them star jumps. That's what we call them in Australia. Go get that heart rate up, get that blood pumping. Three, two, one. Down into mountain climbers. Push it, push it. You can always walk this. That's it. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Up into those butt kicks. Good. So those heels up to your hands. We're swapping into high knees. Let's go, last one. Fifteen seconds. Fourteen. Thirteen. Keep those legs up. Let's go. Seven. Six. Five seconds. Four. Three. Two. One. And break. All right. Awesome work. Okay. So now that we've warmed up. We're gonna get into the workout. So, everything is around 20 to 30 seconds, okay? So you won't be doing anything for more than 20 to 30 seconds, and you're just gonna follow along with me. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so we're down on the ground, guys, and the first exercise you need to know, and the only exercise you need to know, is plank jacks, because after that, you're just following along with me. So, it's out, in, out, in, out, in. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Let's go, 30 seconds. Out, in, out, in, out, in. Now, you can walk this in and out like so if you do not want to jump it in and out. So if you watch me now, you can walk it in and out. That's it, keep going. You have five seconds, four, three, two, one, and up. So this is where the cardio comes in. So we're gonna go abs, cardio. So kicking your bum. That's it. Really focus, breathe. 15 seconds. 10 seconds. Five. Four, three, two, one. Down the ground, bent leg jackknife. Now ladies, if you have a drink bottle or you've got a dumbbell, you can actually hold it now in your hands to make this a little bit harder. If you feel like your back is arching, which are my back arches, I lift my head up and press my lower back into the ground. So you can do that. You've got five seconds, guys. Five, four, three, two, 
Wow, let's go into mountain climbers. That's good. So again, you can walk these in and out. So just make sure right now you're not staring down at your feet. Your shoulder and your wrist is in line. And you're running on the spot. So don't look down at your feet. Five, four, three, two, one, and crisscross. That's it. So you're just crossing your front foot over. This is a great alternative to skipping as well. So normally I would add skipping, but not everyone has a skipping rope. So I'm going to do this instead. 10 seconds. Seven, six, five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Wow, I'm going to do a side plank now. You can drop your knee onto the ground, up to you, but I'm coming up like this. And we're holding that side plank. Hold that side plank. Don't drop down. Don't come up too high. Nice and straight. You can stagger your feet. You can actually place one foot in front of the other, but on top of the, on top of the other, sorry. But I wouldn't. A few seconds, we're gonna swap sides. Three, two, one, other side. That's it. Now, same as mountain climbers, as I was saying, you wanna have your wrist and shoulder in line, you also wanna have your elbow and your shoulder in line when you're doing the side plank. We're moving into our favorite exercise, guys. <laughs> I say this every time. We've got 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, we're moving into commandos in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Straight into commandos. You can swap hands. You can do a few on one hand, a few on the other. You can also drop down to your knees, so don't forget. You can always drop down to your knees and modify this. It's perfect. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we're just gonna do that exact same thing as we did in our warm up as a little break. So we're going back, stretching out just for a few seconds. Down, stretch those abs out. That's good. A few seconds here. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Straight leg raise. That's perfect. Straight leg raise. Now you can modify this. You can do it alternating if you like. You can bend, totally up to you. Again, I'm lifting my head up. We've got 10 seconds, nine, eight. We're up into high knees in seven, six, five, four, three, two, and high knees, let's go. High knees. Okay, you should really start to lean your core now. So keep that core nice and strong as you bring your knees up. Good, good, good. Keep it going. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, one. And we're going to an X plane. Touching our opposite foot. We've got two exercises to go before we can break. I'm going to repeat this again for round two. Opposite foot. Well done. Ten seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, stay where you are. We're going to do X mountain climbers. We're going to cross our body. You can walk this out. You can run this if you want, but I feel it more as I'm walking through it, trying to concentrate, bringing my knee to my elbow. And my abs are truly burning right now. That's it. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, you got five seconds, four, three, two, one, 
down into jumping jacks. Woo! And you can have a break after this to grab a drink, but we're going to finish this off. 15 seconds, 14, 13, 12, 11, last 10 seconds for a break, 9, 8, 7, 6, last 5 seconds, 4, keep it going, 3, 2, 1, and break. Okay, well done everyone, grab a drink, we are going to do that all over again. Okay, so I'm going to give you a 30 second break. While we're doing this break, you can actually do that stretch again. So if you're on the ground right now, grabbing a drink, you can just stretch out your abs ready for round two. Otherwise you can just have a little bit of a breather. With abs, you need to make sure that you're not holding your breath when you're doing it. That's the number one mistake. People hold their breath as they're doing the ab exercise. We don't want to do that. We want to make sure we try and breathe as normal as possible through these. All right. Woo, huffing and puffing. Okay, we're ready for round two. We're starting with plank jacks. Take a big, deep breath. So in through your nose, out through your mouth. I'm gonna get straight into those plank jacks. So this is round two. Starting in three, two, one. Let's go, plank jacks. So out and back in. We got this. 30 seconds. Out, back in again, walking in and out if you need. Walking in and out if you need. Walking in and out if you need. Keep it going, keep it going. You have five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Straight up into butt kicks. Now again, if you're feeling super tired right now, you can walk on the spot, but I don't want you to stop moving. I don't want you to sit down. I know how easy it is right now at home to just sit down or to give up, but I want you to get out of your comfort zone and really push yourself. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, bent leg jackknife. Again, if you have a drink bottle handy, you can pick it up and hold it as a weight. Totally up to you. You want to increase the intensity. That's good. You do not have to go as fast as me as well. You can take it slow. You can drop your knees down to the ground and just touch your feet. Sorry, your feet down to the ground and just touch your feet as they come up. Totally up to you. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and straight into mountain climbers. So I want quick transitions, guys. So you want to transition quickly into the next exercise so you don't miss those seconds. That's it. Again, feeling sore, you can walk this in and out. Really suck inwards. That's it, it's like a vacuum. In and in. Three, two, one, and up. Crisscross. Again, if you have a skipping rope handy, you can skip. This is a great alternative to skipping. For the ladies asking, the alternative to skipping, any of these cardio movements that we're doing in between are great instead of skipping. Five seconds, five, four, three, two, one. Down the ground with that side plank. You can make this harder, you can do little crunches, but for now, let's just hold the side plank. Breathing, 10 seconds, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, other side. Well done, holding that side plank. Again, you can drop down to your knees, ladies. If that's more comfortable for you, drop down to your knees. Absolutely. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and into those commandos. Well done. Again, you can drop down to your knees 
whatever feels more comfortable. I just want you to get this workout done. I want you to get a sweat on at home, in the comfort of your own home. That's it. Keep pushing. 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six. You have five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and stretch it out. Take a second. Breathe, stretch. This is where you just take a few deep breaths in, into your nose, out through your mouth, and really stretch out your abs. Don't relax too much. We're gonna keep going. For 10 seconds more of this. Again, a few deep breaths. Five, four, three, two, one, and we're going straight leg raise. Straight leg raise. Again, feet on the ground, you can bring them up and just touch them. If you want, as an alternative, I'm lifting my head up so my lower back is pressed into the ground. Well done. 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and straight up into high knees. Straight up into high knees. This is my absolute favorite way to train abs. Just mixes it up a little bit. That's it, keep going, feel that core. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and X playing. That's it. Touching, so I touch my foot. You can, like, it's, it's completely up to you. You can touch your knee, if that's all you can do. But I'm trying to get down to my ankle each time. By raising myself up nice and high. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. X mountain timer across your body. So I'm walking this out. You can run it, but I feel it way more walking it out. That's it. Walk it out. Oh my God. I can feel this burning. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, Two, one, jumping jacks. That's it. Woo! I feel like everything's burning right now. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and break. Well done, guys. That's fantastic, but we're still not finished yet. Okay, to end my workouts, I usually do a finisher which has no cardio in it. Okay, this is just pure abs. There are seven exercises. We're gonna do one round. So this is where you need to get out of your comfort zone. This is where you need to push yourself. This is the time when most people feel like giving up. I want you to forget about all that. I want you to get into mindset where you're gonna to say to yourself, let's get this done, let's finish this. All right, so. We're gonna start with a raised leg sit up. Follow along with me, you won't be doing anything for more than 30 seconds. Ready guys? So, the exercise is this. You're gonna try and clap underneath your legs. The closer you bring your legs, the easier it is to clap. So, I leave my legs around here. Seven exercises until we are done. Starting in three, two, one, let's go. So up and clap, up and clap. Little crunch. Now, if you're feeling like this is too much, you can just do a little crunch on the ground, placing your legs down. That's a modification for anyone wanting that. That's it, keep going. Four, three, two. Now this is gonna burn, Russian twist. Now, you can have your feet on the ground and twist, or you can raise them like me and twist from side to side. Now, if this is not burning you right now, God, you're doing better than me because this burns. 
10 Back. seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, keep going. Three, two, one. They're gonna go in, out, out, in, in, out, out, in. So you're gonna half burpee and then you're gonna plank jack. Half burpee and plank jack. Just be grateful I'm not making you do a full burpee, guys. That's it. Your abs should be burning by now. Keep it going, you have 10 seconds. You can walk this in and out, guys. Walk it in and out. Five, four, three, two, one. Lying down, we're going straight into a straight leg sit up. That's it, straight legs. I bend mine slightly as I come up. Straight leg sit up. We got this. There's only three exercises to go. You got 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six. I'm smiling because I know what's coming next. Three, two, one. Okay, so we're gonna do scissors. Yep, that is absolutely burning. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Breathe. We got this. Woo! 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we're doing an alternating X crunch. We are almost done. We've got one exercise to go. And lucky for you, it's not like last week. I'm not going to make you do burpees. I'm actually going to be nice. Or maybe nice isn't the right word, but. <laughs> Let's go, we're almost done, guys. We've got 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we're holding a high plank for the last 30 seconds of the entire workout. Now, if you feel like your wrists are sore, you can make a fist and hold yourself up like this. We're gonna count down from 15 seconds and then we're gonna be done. 15, 14, 13, don't give up now. 11, 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, last five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and done. <sighs> oh my God. Okay, my abs are absolutely burning. Ladies, grab a drink, stretch out those abs. I am so, so proud of you. Now ladies, you know, if you were here last week, I let everyone know I will be here Monday night to help you every Monday night. But until then, download Sweat, start a seven day free trial, 650 at home workouts available that you can do. There are five trainers, something for everyone. And I cannot wait to see you next week. Make sure you share all your pictures, all your photos, all your comments below so I can read them all. I will see you next week for another session. Bye.